If you plan to deploy a wireless network using your 48 as a wireless controller and a 40 access point, then you need to be familiar with two basic terms, SSID and 40 AP profile. Keep on watching. To get more easy setup tips for your 48 firewall, subscribe now and don't forget to click on the bell notification and you won't miss anything. Your 40AP wireless network is actually a layered network. That is, it is comprised of three main components. The first one is the physical access point, that is the 40AP. The second one is the SSID, which is actually the virtual wireless network interface where you configure the interface IP address, the interface DHCP server with its IP address range pool, security settings, either WPA Enterprise or WPA2 Personal, and lately also WPA3. And one of the components or one of the ingredients of that virtual interface is the SSID identifier. That is the name of the wireless network that is being broadcasted in the air using a beacon frame. Now, this third component is actually the 40 AP profile. That is the radio settings. You can configure different radio settings. If your access point has one or two or three radios, will it work on a 2.4 gigahertz band or the five gigahertz band? Will the channel width will be 20 megahertz, 40 megahertz, 80 megahertz? Will transmission power be automatic or you want to configure it manually? And then you can assign one or more SSIDs to that specific 40 AP profile. So let's try to recap. We have a virtual wireless interface that we have just created. We have also named that interface and we have also named the SSID identifier, the service set identifier, which is the name of the wireless network. Those wireless networks are being associated to different radio models of that access point, which are represented as the 40AP profile. 